special. A challenging past year for all of us, and in West Haven, there's thinking outside the box and thinking outside the pizza box. This is a bit of both. Not only is it delicious, it's communal. I mean, it's the epitome of breaking bread, right? I would say this is definitely power of pizza. But you're gonna have pizza prowess. Handcuffed by the constraints of COVID-19, Colin Kaplan, the owner of Taste of New Haven Food Tours, is delivering a taste of Connecticut to the country. While his tours are shut, his virtual pizza project is launching. With the help of Jimmy Ormrod, the fourth generation owner of legendary Zuparties of Pete's, it's a chance to get their cut in a new way. So we have a Pizza in America series. This is a virtual pizza event. There's actually gonna be dozens of these. Every Tuesday, we have a pizza cooking class. We've got a pizza learning lesson about history, whether it's New York, Buffalo, uh, New Haven, Italy, doesn't matter. Pizzainamerica.com. Colin and Jimmy are taking to Zoom from Zapartis. I love to do it. I, I love making pizza in wood fire ovens. I love making pizza in home ovens, in our oven, any oven, coal ovens. My goal is to make it easy for them, less intimidating for them, and share my passion of, of making pizza with people at home. This is an amazing testament to how much pizza has become and still is relevant in our world, whether it's pre-COVID, during COVID, or after COVID, everyone needs to eat, everyone wants to make pizza, and everyone wants to learn about pizza. The feeling is there's power behind Connecticut pizza. It's because the best pizza makers and the best ingredients are right here. That's why we have the best pizza, and that's why it's synonymous with Connecticut. Pizza's the way of life. Interested in one of Colin and Jimmy's master classes? We will put all the information on our website at fox61.com and on the Fox 61 News app. And by the way, Colin is now working with the state legislator to get pizza, yes, recognized as the official food of Connecticut. That'll be an interesting story to follow in the weeks ahead. In West Haven, Jim Altman, Fox 61 News.